Hi and welcome to the session. I am Deepika here. Let's discuss a question. In the following situation, does the list of numbers involved make an arithmetic progression and why? The amount of money in the account every year when rupees 10,000 is deposited at compound interest at 8% per annum. Let's start the solution. We know that an arithmetic progression is a list of numbers in which each term is obtained by adding a fixed number to the preceding term except for the first term. And also amount for n years is given by a n is equal to p into 1 plus r over 100 raised to power n where p is the principal, r is the rate of interest. So we will find the terms according to the given situation and we will see whether they form an arithmetic progression or not. Let's start the solution using the key idea. Solution. Here P is given to us rupees 10,000. R is given to us R is equal to 8%. There and therefore amount for first year is equal to P that is ten thousand one plus R that is eight upon hundred raised to power one which is equal to 10,000 into 100, 8, 1 plus 8 over 100. Again, amount for second year is is equal to 10,000 into 1 plus 8 over 100 raised to power 2. Similarly, amount for third year is 10,000 is equal to 10,000 into 1 plus 8 over 100 raised to power 3. So therefore we have the terms as follows. Ten thousand one plus eight over hundred. Ten thousand one plus 8 over 100 is to power 2 which was the amount for the second year and next is 10,000 1 plus 8 over 100 is to power 3 and so on. Now we see that each term is not obtained by by adding a fixed number to the preceding term Therefore, it does not form an AP. Hence, answer for the above situation is no. The above situation does not form an AP and amounts are
and so on i hope the question is clear to you bye and have a nice day